What's up, Fishy family? This is Maclean, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, as you read by the title of this video, today's video it's gonna be like preparing calcium using eggshells. So, the whole idea of this YouTube channel is to make you guys know different types of things which you have in your house and which you discard, thinking that they are not useful, but you can use them in your aquarium or something like an aquarium product. So, in today's video, I'm gonna tell you how you can convert this eggshells into calcium and use them in your aquarium so before getting started yeah so before getting started most of you guys will be like Marklin why do we need calcium so I'll be talking two points like why do we need calcium uh, because I personally keep guppies and shrimps all my in all my setups they are guppies and shrimps so I'll be talking in first of in terms of guppies so one of the reasons for crooked spine in guppies is a lack of calcium so if you have calcium right it's very useful they won't get crooked spine there are many other reasons but one of the reasons like out of hundreds of reasons one of the reasons is a lack of calcium now the second point why do we need a, a calcium so most of the people who keep shrimps they know that uh, shrimp uh, for their growth they mold and whenever they mold right they need calcium they need enough calcium for the next uh, for the next uh, shell to become hard if they don't have enough calcium uh, their shells will be very bad and the other the third reason which I remember just now is for snails if you look at uh, some of the snails they have white color patches on their shells it's because they don't have enough calcium to make their shells hard so I'll be telling you how you can how we can make this into this that is calcium this is calcium powder so I hope you guys like videos like this. Uh, if, you, uh, if you guys like videos like this, do let me know down in the comments because I would love to make more videos like this. Uh, the whole goal of this channel is to help you guys uh, make this hobby way more easier. Um, because I don't want you guys to go to the shop and buy calcium, which will cost you more. Instead of that, uh, eggs will be available in most of the people's house. If you are non-veg, you will definitely have eggs in your house. So you can use these eggshells and make calcium for your aquariums so before further ado just get right into the video uh, so yeah guys i'm in my kitchen now so the thing is uh, i've kept some eggshells ready yeah uh, some kept some eggshells ready here so what i've done is that uh, i've nicely dried them up and kept so these eggshells i'll be putting uh, in this mixture now you can just smash it and put it inside or you can directly put it inside like this but uh, I prefer to smash it and put it inside so I just smash it up like this and put it inside so now what I'll just on the mixture and just uh, powder it up I won't show that part because uh, there'll be a lot of disturbance uh, because of the mixture so now I'll uh, powder this up and after the powder is done I'll show you how it looks yeah you can see the air coming out of it so the powdering is uh, yeah so the powdering is actually done so this is how do, uh, how you prepare your own calcium in the house so now what i'll do is that i'll show you how i add this calcium in my aquarium uh yeah so now i'll go inside my fish room and directly show you guys how i add calcium to my aquarium yeah guys as you can see i'm back in my fish room this uh this is the tank in which i'll be adding the calcium uh, so there are two methods which I follow uh, one thing what you can do is that you can just uh, take a little bit of uh, calcium and just sprinkle it up how much you want it is mixed up because it will get mixed up because there is a sponge filter going on this is one method the other method which I follow is uh, I'll take a cup like this take some water I'll keep this here take little calcium add it here mix it up nicely and then how much I want I just put it up like this yeah so just be careful there's not exact method how much I put uh, in this tanks but do be uh, be careful not to add too much into your tanks because uh, it's not good if you add too much calcium for aquarium uh, yeah so eventually what will happen is that all this uh, calcium will eventually come down and will get here and the snails will come and feed on it uh, I hope you guys like this video uh, if you liked and enjoyed this video uh, please do hit that like button and also know, let me know down in the comments uh, about which video you want to see next 
uh, also subscribe to my YouTube channel. It means a lot uh, because when, uh, whenever you people subscribe to my YouTube channel, right, I get motivated to do more videos like this. Uh, see you guys in the next video. Until then, happy fishkeeping. Bye bye.